Okay, this is a tutorial on how to open JPEG images in the Photoshop Camera Raw program. And Photoshop Camera Raw is something that's built into Photoshop, but it doesn't automatically open stuff in in Camera Raw unless it's a raw photo. And so if you're working with raw photos and you just plain open it, you know, right click and open with with uh, Adobe Photoshop CS3, then it will automatically open in Camera Raw. But with JPEGs, it takes a little workaround um, initially. And so here's the image we're going to open. So instead of going to open with uh, Adobe Photoshop, we're going to want to open it with Adobe Bridge the first time. Okay, so I'm going to go to Other because it's not one of the options. And then I'll click Adobe Bridge and then, whoops, and then see Bridge CS3. So I'll click there. Oh, and I lost the, it's 4562 is the image I'm looking for. Okay, now I know it's image 4562. There it is. Okay, see, and it's, oops, it's selected there. So you can see it. Now, what you're going to want to do is right click on it and then open in camera raw. Now, that should work, but there is a possibility that that won't work. And if it doesn't, um, then you'll want to go up to this corner. Uh, Bridge CS3 and then Camera Raw Preferences and here you can set this JPEG and TIFF handling. Always open JPEGs with settings using Camera Raw and you can also tell it to do the same with TIFFs. I believe that is what will fix it. If that doesn't I'll show you in a second what, what I'll do it. Anyway, let's, so let's right click that one and open in Camera Raw. Now here's the Camera Raw program. Now uh, you may wonder if you've never used Camera Raw before, why would I want to open in this? It just looks like an alternative to, uh, to Photoshop. All this basically is for is for uh, adjusting the lighting, the white balance, the color, basically all the settings that your camera would be be able to set. Um, so on your camera you can set the contrast. So you can adjust contrast on here. Um, you can adjust the um, exposure. You can adjust the uh, color, uh, the hue balance, things like that. So, so there's lots of things like, see you've got the exposure you can adjust really easily. Um, and you and you've got the you know, recovery is kind of nice if you got too much like a bright spot that's kind of almost unrecoverable kind of a spot that'll help balance that a little bit turn up the blacks that'll darken the dark areas a little more contrast will darken the darkens and lighten the lights um, so forth you can play around with these different things you can also go up to another one that I like this little squiggly line adjust the colors so you can uh, change all the red colors to some other color as you can see the orange the red that's in that orange is adjusting a little bit if we were to adjust the orange that would be interesting because there's a lot of orange in it see and you can adjust individual color areas and i'm going to put those back to zero and then you can click change the saturation and I'm like I want that orange to really shine so turn that way up or if you're like ah, I don't want that to look orange turn it all the way down or whatever um, anyway play with those different settings but that and then uh, so now that you've got it in camera raw you can do all your adjustments and then click open image
and then it takes you to ordinary Photoshop. If you're finished, then just click File, Save As, and, and save your image. I'm going to give it a new title and save. So that is how you open uh, a JPEG in Photoshop Camera Raw.